How to add voice changer in Streamlabs. Adding a voice changer in Streamlabs OBS can add fun and entertainment by allowing you to alter your voice during your stream. Here's how we can do it. We are going to go to our browser and then here you can just type on Google uh, say clownfish. And then after typing clownfish, you will be able to see something like this. We're going to open that one. So this is clownfish voice changer. This is what we're going to use. And the reason why I prefer this one is basically because it's for free. So you can basically opt here to donate if you want, or if you can just use it just as it is. So I'm going to click download here. And then you have here the options to download. So my computer is 64 bit. So I'm going to be choosing this one. All right, click save. And then from here, what you're going to do is just basically install this one. Okay, now it's completed. We're going to click next. So after installing that one, we're going to just go here. And then basically we're going to open our clownfish. All right, there you go. And then we're going to click set voice changer. So from here, I'm going to say, for example, choose helium pitch. Very good. So now I'm using the helium pitch and you can see that it is active if we are going to see it here. So you, this is the helium pitch and I kind of pretty like this one. So this is very popular. I think this is also known as the chipmunk voice. And then I also have here the baby pitch. There you go. So now I'm using the baby pitch and you also have here different options to choose from. So we have, for example, uh, the male pitch. Uh, this is the male pitch and I'm basically just saying the same thing. It's just that it's a voice changer doing the magic. All right. Now, say for example, you don't want to use this anymore. All you have to do is just go down here and then click clear effect. So after clicking clear effect, you can see that I'm using now my usual voice. And you can also see that it's not active anymore. So there's a status here saying inactive. And again, that's how you're going to add voice changer in Streamlabs OBS. Basically, you don't need to add it here in your microphone settings because you won't see it here anyway. So it just works in every software in your computer that uses the microphone. And yes, congratulations. Now you have a new knowledge and I hope everything has been clear, everybody. And by the way, I would highly suggest to upgrade to Streamlabs Ultra to level up your streaming quality and experience. You can save up to $10 of discount right away after clicking on the link in the description box and the comment section below. As always, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and leave this video a like if this helps you out.